هي اكبر مكان معروف ظهرت فيه السفن الشراعيه حيث يظهر فقار مصر قديم يرجع تاريخه الى حوالي 3100 قبل الميلاد سفينه يبقى لازم عندنا ايه؟ لازم يبقى عندنا قاعده خشب وايه؟ وشراع اسمي جهاد جمال محمد عبد الله بعمل ميسرات في الفيوم دلوقتي يا اولاد احنا هنبص عليكم المراكب اللي هيتم تنفيذها بالفعل ماشي. The lesson she's giving her students is titled Creating the Egyptian Boat in Your Mind, aiming to inspire them to learn about science by constructing a sailboat. Why did the boat sink? This experience highlights that invention and creativity require scientific knowledge to support them. Fortunately, Gahad has expert assistance. Since 2020, we have been collaborating with UNESCO, Egyptian Ministry of Education and Technical Education on the Open Schools project. The teacher's community in this country is the biggest ever. And Egypt has decided to be part of uh, all the process related to the transformation of education. With the assistance of the Open Schools project, Gahad Gamal gained a deeper understanding of STEM subjects and knew the better way to guide her students to achieve their goals. بالنسبه لطلابي بدات افهمهم واوصلهم ان المجموع ان المعلومه مش من خلال الكتب بس. So uh, really technology can be in the future and now a good asset for improving accessibility and the quality of education. She told her students, through teamwork and positive thinking, it is possible to build an Egyptian ship that truly sails. Through the lessons, they can constantly expand the boundaries of their curiosity, shaping their understanding of this changing world. We often use a proverb, if you want to walk fast, walk alone. If you want to walk far, walk together. At present, we have numerous partners walking hand in hand, offering digital technology to everyone. Our educational vessel is propelled towards a more diverse, open, inclusive, and sustainable future. <laughs>